Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we're playing some Prison Architect. This video is sponsored by Paradox Interactive, so thank you very much to them. Uh, we've played a lot of this on the channel before, so you probably already know kind of the story. But the new DLC Going Green just came out, which is all involving uh, farms and stuff like that. So I'm looking forward to making a free range prison. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bit depressing. All right, let's get started. Oh, so the DLC comes out on the 28th, but, but the game is free to play on Steam for the weekend if you want to check it out. I would highly advise you to do so. Super, super fun game. Oh, and it's also on the Xbox Game Pass for PC. All right, let's get started. So I've picked an island. I'm an island boy myself, you know, coming from Ireland. And uh, we got our shipments coming in <laughs> of workmen <laughs> and supplies. I should really get started a bit sooner because I don't want them to be free range immediately. Like, I got to get them inside the walls or something. I was just looking at the features here and I saw narcotic production. I was like, oh yeah, I can make them grow drugs. <laughs> but no, this is a bad thing. Like, they'll be trying to sneakily grow the drugs and I should try and stop them. <laughs> oh, why did my mind go to the other one? Oh, no. Oh, I accidentally placed the perimeter wall and deleted it and I just cost myself four grand. <sighs> All right, <laughs> let's all do a bad start. That was like a sixth of my money. Oh. oh my God, I did it again. I've lost half my money. You know what? I don't think this was a good idea. Hold on. I, I'm backing out. <laughs> They're like, well, guys, I've spent half your money. Um, I've accomplished nothing. I think I should resign, to be honest with you. All right, create new prison. <laughs> let's just start again. I'll get a job somewhere else where they've never heard of me. All right, unlimited funds. That's better. <laughs> and my dog will be once again a cat as always. Okay, play. <laughs> New job, new me. There we go. Now I can go into the minus. <laughs> I'm already negative. I just started. All right, I'm really going for the like cult compound kind of feel. So I'm just going to make like kind of just free range. I have a few cells down here, but they can just wander into the gardens and grow the drugs for me. You know? <laughs> grow the crops for me. Let's just make their cells out of hay. <laughs> there you go. It's even been built so quick. Wait, what is this? I think our hay bale wall is rotting. Oh, no. Oh, some prisoners have arrived. I'm not ready. I'm still building your hay jail cells. Where are all the workers? Oh, they're stuck. What's wrong with you? <laughs> What's wrong? There you go. You're all free. Not you guys. You stay there. We got an honor system in place here. Please don't walk away. Oh my god. You're absolutely useless without me, aren't you? Hold on. Let me just open this door permanently. There we go. Locked open. There we go. Work through the night, men. Don't worry, guys. You'll be in jail soon enough. They're all complaining about warmth. We just left them there. All right, let's make a reception somewhere, I guess. I should probably have a reception so I can actually bring these people in. Also, should I hire some staff? Because right now it's just the builders going like, are we also the guards or? <laughs> First of all, I got to finish their cells. I made them like so much room for cells and then realized that I don't want to be that nice. So I made them single file. I'm not sure how that's even going to work, but I guess we're going to find out. Also, I replaced the perimeter wall with the hay bale wall for the back of their cells. Oh, they've locked themselves in the cells. Well, I hope you're not the guards as well because you're not very good at it. This guy's got it all figured out. The rest of them are like Drake and Josh building a treehouse without a door. <laughs> They're all just stuck. All right, staff. Guard. All right, now do stuff. <laughs> I'm not sure what I want you to do, but just figure it out. You're the guard, not me. I don't know what to do. Oh my God, if I have guards, they can open the doors for the builders and I don't have to be micromanaging it. Okay, I'm getting lots of guards now. I see the benefit of having them. Oh my God, I just realized the hay bale says outdoor only. These jail cells are useless now. Tear it all down. <laughs> They're like, are you serious? You spent all night making this. All right, what about this derelict wall? I like how I have unlimited money <laughs> and I'm just using these cheap materials. Also, I don't like this flooring anymore. Replace it with a nice, uh, uh, <laughs> carpet. Oh my God, not more prisoners arriving. We're not even ready for the original ones. Oh my God, how many of you have arrived here? <laughs> no, not more, stop it. Some of them look deadly ill. <laughs> okay, there we go. I've actually built the room, finally. Okay, that's just one big holding cell now because I've grown tired of building walls that are falling apart. So there's all these doors. So many points of weakness. Imagine like, did I lock up today? <laughs> and you're just thinking of all the doors. I get paranoid enough just on my front door. Not to mind this. Prisoners due for release. They were never locked up. <laughs> oh my God, it looks so bad. 
<laughs> Feed all prisoners, they man exclamation marks. All right, hold on, we'll get them in here. The general quality of our cell is too low. What do you mean? <laughs> Can I make this into a, a reception area? It's already kind of built. It's a bit derelict, but sure, look, I'm building derelict walls onto it, so it all works. Oh, secret door <laughs> for no reason. Go into the reception. There's an outdoor bookcase. There's a hole and it's like leaking. Oh, I think it's because we're building on sand. Oh, even in Minecraft, this would be a bad idea. Can we fill that up with dirt? <laughs> all right, I need a toilet and a bench. Small, <laughs> small bench. <laughs> that should do them, right? There's only 64 prisoners out there waiting to come in. Okay, one toilet in the middle of the cell. And where's the bench? <laughs> there we go, bench. Oh, wait, no, bench small. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, bench small, right, right in front of the toilet. There we go. <laughs> Just this tire down the... I know, he must be all so tired. Yes, look at them. They all come marching in 64 by 64. I was going to say one by one, but no, they're, they're all just coming in. How come I've played this game so many times, yet this must be the worst prison I've ever started? <laughs> like, you'd think experience would bring wisdom, but no, it seems to be the opposite in my case. Oh my god, there's already people bleeding out. How are you dead? Killed for being a snitch? What did you snitch on? <laughs> it's not like we're going to do anything about it anyway. This one's unconscious. Oh my god, they're rioting. Why are you all so upset? Oh, now you leave. And now you're rioting and they're just going off into the sea. Two escapes today, three deaths. I finally locked them up and they decide, you know what? I don't like this old prison thing. We should have left when we were out on the road. Well, this is just disappointing, honestly, lads. I'm sure you'll cheer up when I give you some outdoor activities like farms. I might have to do that sooner rather than later. So let's get started while the riot's going on. <laughs> a whole riot behind the warden and he's just like, yeah, this would be a nice spot for a vegetable patch. Right, vegetable allotment. That's right, we're going big. Fruit orchard. Farming field. Do you like how they're not the same sizes? Like the middle one's slightly bigger. Does that help your OCD? <laughs> I'm gonna change this reception to a morgue. I think I need it more. There we go. Morgue slab. Just gonna get a lot of those. Not that I'll need them. It's just keep it symmetrical. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Or what if I could double up on this room, actually? I'm just throwing away these brand new <laughs> morgue slabs. <laughs> Do you think there's a good market for secondhand morgue slabs? Hardly used. Uh, kitchen might be good. Is that big enough? Yeah, it is. Awesome. <laughs> Bit unsanitary, but awesome. Cooker, fridge, tall fridge, sink. Okay, I'm on it. <laughs> I redirected the pipe halfway through construction, and I was just like, just leave those there. Or are we having another riot or something? You guys want to leave? Why would you want to leave? I've just built you a kitchen. <laughs> Luckily, I've just built the morgue as well, so those four debts, I have plenty of room for you. In fact, I have two extra slabs. Any other two people want to die? Anyone? <laughs> oh, they're all cheering because I'm building them sheds now. That's nice. All right, this is not working. Like, they're all rioting and fighting each other. I gotta build something to intimidate them, I think. You know what this might be? Oh my god, I never even hooked up the toilet. It doesn't even work. There's no water. Oh, that's gonna be backed up. So much bodily fluid. Everything from blood to whatever this is. Jeez, they're like worker ants. They build like, I don't know, what what? Actually, I do. It's like worker ants, which is what I originally said, but all right. <laughs> and now that that is built, I want to build the um, intimidation uh, execution room in here. And they can watch as it happens. This is what happens if you keep killing each other. I'll keep killing you. That. <laughs> Hmm. Oh, it's the mayor probably calling to congratulate me. Yellow. A disaster at a nearby prison. We have no choice but to transfer the prisoners there to your prison. If there's a disaster there, prison, what do you call this? <laughs> Is this not a disaster? If so, thank you. <laughs> that means a lot. And I only need one object for this, which is great because it's hard to concentrate with all that rioting. <laughs> We're gonna put in the electric chair. In fact, this prison might need two. <laughs> now let's get some serious power lines powering that thing. We might need actually more power <laughs> than we have right now. Wait, who is this? Are you on death row? I don't know. Oh, I can't just decide to kill him. <laughs> I guess uh, I'm not judge, jury, and executioner, I suppose. Oh my god, I thought they were leaving them. I thought they were leaving them out. I thought they'd done their time, but no, they were just bringing them to the morgue. And these people are still injured from the attempt to escape. They forgot we were on an island and they don't know how to swim. No, dismiss vehicle. <laughs> the ambulance showed up and I'm like, nah, <laughs> go away. Oh my god, four people criminally insane? They weren't insane when they got here. 
earlier, so I caused this. All right, they clearly need farms stat. I should probably like close this door. It's locked open. So if they get out of here, they're just free to go essentially. What is wrong with the... Oh, it's overloaded. Power stations must not be connected to each other. Okay, my bad. <laughs> okay, everyone, you've got your power back. Are you happy now? No, <laughs> I don't think the lighting was their main uh, problem with me. All right, let's get some crops to cheer everyone up, shall we? Uh, farming rooms, landing crops. Shut up about the quality of the cells. It's not about the quality of the cells, it's about the quality of the person. And the quality of me is nothing to boast about. <laughs> but there's nothing that can change that right now. There we go, corn. <laughs> Sorry, corn is funny. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why I found that funny. I was just like, yeah, corn. <laughs> Tomatoes, they are not funny. Potatoes, they are funny. Oh, but I can't plant them. God damn it. Oranges. Is anyone scheduled to die yet? Oh no, but we've less criminally insane people. So they either, I don't know, were healed from their illnesses or they died. <laughs> either way, <laughs> good for me, I suppose. There we go. Good luck, chef. You're gonna see some nasty shit. Oh my god, I spawned one in the water. I'm so sorry. I didn't even know I could do that. Oh, good night, sweet prince. <laughs> I was gonna show you the kitchen, but I guess I'll be showing you the morgue instead. Luckily for me, it doesn't affect my daily routine because they're the same thing. All right, you know what might be a good idea? Hiring a doctor. Like, I'm working on a canteen, but <laughs> I think a doctor might be a better idea. <laughs> uh, should I build an infirmary? I guess I could build it onto the side of the morgue. <laughs> oh, it's raining. <laughs> well, that's good for the crops anyway, I suppose. I just have a bad feeling about it because well the prison is not built well as you can tell by the flooding <laughs> honestly that might just be all the human waste <laughs> just seeping out from the walls <laughs> they are complaining about their bowels and bladder <laughs> don't worry you'll have a doctor to complain to soon as soon as i finish off the canteen slash shower room the good news is although the prison seems to be doing badly we're in profit which is the main thing some would say rehabilitation some would say, you know, keeping the prisoners safe or fed or warm or sane. But I think profit <laughs> is, is just trumps all of them. All right, infirmary. I think that should do it. Just so I can do a little expansion to the morgue. Because <laughs> honestly, it's really needed. There we go. Just make sure you get in the right bed if you come in for a checkup. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay, never mind. You can just go into the other bed. <laughs> they just arrived and they immediately died. I don't think that we're actually helping people here, Doc. <laughs> he's just checking their pulse and being like, oh, no, he's actually dead. <laughs> just move him to the other one. Our morgue just got an expansion and it's already full look at all that food though no human meat for us but if we do need it <laughs> as a healthy supply we are at risk of a fire breaks out that's the last thing on my mind right now i'm mainly thinking about corn so that's just going well that's the only thing that's going well to be honest oh look at that ripe corn that is fantastic the tomatoes are going along great the orange trees are maturing nicely everything's going great i bought you a wheelbarrow full of flowers to try and make you guys feel better oh and a garden gnome to piss you off everyone hates garden gnomes and i'm buying fertilizer god knows why when i could just get it from here <laughs> it's all piling on the floor anyway <sighs> What is it, Doc? I know they're all dying. <laughs> food poisoning? I don't even feed them. How are they getting food poisoning? <laughs> the food in the kitchen must be soiled. I wonder why. <laughs> oh my God. So much death. So much disease. Look at all this bounty. There's so much corn. <laughs> and when I'm not feeding my prisoners, it's just a, such a profit machine. Look how much money I have. All this corn. <laughs> There's so much corn. <gasps> is that grief for Jesus? <laughs> it's about time he caught what was coming to him. Prisoner boss. No, no, bring the corn bosses in. Oh, we're flooding. <laughs> All right, well, they're being fed now, at least. Oh, that riled them up. Jesus, turns out the people who weren't killing each other just weren't doing because they didn't have the energy to do it. 29, 30 deaths. That is a record. I should have never fed them. I knew it. I fe it felt wrong. <laughs> it felt really wrong, but I did it anyway because the game kept telling me to. Okay, a lot of them are just swimming to safety. Well, swimming to their death because we're on an island. Like, there's nowhere to go. <laughs> they're escaping, but they're escaping to their death. They're probably praying that I'll allow them in here. <laughs> right, I bought a foreman to allow prison labor. <laughs> We've room to take in more prisoners. Yeah, because 35 people died today. And honestly, even then, I don't think we have the room for them. Mm, they're mixing up the beds again. They're putting the dead people on the... Oh, wait, maybe they just died. Yeah, that's probably more, more likely what happened. That's okay. Well, it's not, but I uh, it's correct. Uh, the procedure is what I'm saying. God, so many are just walking out and leaving. <laughs> You've heard of revolving door prisons, but have you heard of open door prisons? Look at all those tomatoes. I'm going to be 
rich. I'm just waiting for a teacher to come in and teach them how to, to farm because then I won't have to pay farmers to do it and I'm even more profitable. You know what this place needs? A potato farm. That'll cheer everyone up. Oh, shower's flooding. Oh, that's because there's no drains. He's unconscious. He just went unconscious in the shower. How did he even get in there? Oh, he's dead, by the way. He died fast. There we go. Plant all of the potatoes. Farm work safety. Only six are interested. Oh, oh, now three. Oh, no, back up to six. Well, we're starting that class soon if anyone is interested. I, I don't know. They're very interested in parole hearings, but I'm not doing that. Treatment of drug addiction. No. <laughs> Spiritual guidance. No, I, I don't think so. I just want you to learn how to make potatoes. Uh, we can get rid of all these sleep slots. I don't really like that. Get rid of the free time as well. Wait, where the hell did you guys come from? <laughs> they just emerged from the sea. <laughs> I have sea monsters as my new guards. Screw eating. You're going to learn how to do stuff. <laughs> You're going to be farmers. Can I just open this door so people can go to the class if they want to? I'll just leave it open. Is that okay? I should probably get something to stop them escaping though because they'll just walk out. Sniper's on to do the trick. There we go. We've started the class. Perfect. We're getting people signing up. This is awesome. Wait. Oh, you're the teacher. Sorry. Warden, come on. I've got better things to be doing. I'm teaching them how to grow potatoes. Subsidence of the land has destroyed a part of the outer wall. That's fine. They want to be here anyway. You know what might be a good idea? If we build some walls to go here, right? Okay. Stay with me here. Demolish this so the morgue has a nice open plan to combine with the kitchen and infirmary. Build another wall there. And then we demolish those walls. Walls. And then they're just free range. They can go about their farming and make me a fortune. I'm doing a shakedown because now that it's like a totally locked down prison, I may as well look for a contraband and then nothing's getting in or out after this. They're checking in all the bags of corn and everything. <laughs> Oh, someone who is doing the course has died. That is a major problem. The people who want to learn something aren't lasting very long. Oh my god, look at all these snipers just camping the bridge like if they ever find a way out, they're done for. This poor farmer is waiting to teach them and no one's showing up. Anyone who's interested is just dying. I just realized I forgot about the secret door so they can still get in or out. You know what? That's probably a good thing because I'm bringing in some beds. I'm hoping they'll sleep and then they'll actually want to learn, but oh, I I don't know if they remember what sleep is. Who the hell are you? Why are you dressed like that? If I can search him, he looks like a vampire. He's up to something. Oh, look at them in bed. They look, they look so scary. Is that the vampire dude? What do you want me to do with you guys? Like, you want to be locked up, but there are no free cells. Like, we're, we're not that kind of prison. We're free range. Free range, goddammit. Although there are a lot of dead bodies being brought out. Perhaps you can take their spot. Oh my god. Yes. They're learning. He's like, is it something about food? You got food here? And he's like, no, no, I will teach you how to make your own food. Are you? Oh, you are. You're fertilizing the plants. God, you've learned a lot. Okay, everyone. I have made the first self-sufficient prison. We can now fire everyone. And this is a million dollar idea. I'm already up to like a third of my goal here. Guards, uh, you can mostly go. I'll let you stay. We'll keep the snipers. <laughs> this poor fecker is just like brushing the field. <laughs> You're fired. You're wasting my time. Doctor is not healing anyone. They're all just dying. We'll keep the teacher. And that's about it. 19 staff and the rest is self-sufficient. Everyone, <sighs> mission accomplished. If that ain't a sign of success, I don't know what is. <laughs> it's just a beautiful, beautiful prison. But I think we'll end it there. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you, Paradox Interactive, for the sponsor. Really appreciate it. Really, really love the game. If you want to play it, it's free for the weekend, as I said. You can test it out. DLC comes out on the 28th. There will be a link in the description if you want to check that out. But thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you tomorrow. Bye for now. Wait, why are the deaths going up? No, no, I perfected it. I don't understand. Uh, let's just pretend that didn't happen. It's, uh, it's goodbye. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Uh...